Hi. So this is a song, story, poem that I wrote in a tree set in Mount Hood National Forest in Eagle Creek. And it was in a tree set 150 feet up in a tree set village that we were sitting in to save the forest. Um, it was the first new moon of January 2001 and it was a snowstorm. I was sitting in this tree set village solo for a week and a snowstorm came and it blanketed the whole forest in snow and I awakened it was beautiful and it was quiet. Well, the whole forest was normally filled with owls and bird song and flying squirrels, and lots of activity and it was suddenly the loudest silence I've ever heard and there's very powerful meditations for me that day. Uh, my name was gifted to me from the cedar tree. It's another story and the uh, this poem came through with a request for me to share it with people, to remember the forest and to do what you can for the trees. They're our lungs, they help us breathe. As you go walking in the city, look up two hundred feet. See where the trees once stood. When the wind blows in the city, think of the people living in trees. Our kind live in the forest to save the forest from our kind. Graffitied on our platform homes, we live without walls, without heat, with the beat of the drum and the song of the birds as our radio. We live in the snow, we do so happily, counting our blessings that our journey brings us here. Here we sit, we read up on the people's history, how the language was beaten out of stolen native children's tongues. We read the Lord of the Rings, and we recognize the old forest and the dreams these trees give us. These trees were here before America. These trees were here before Columbus. These trees were here before us, before us. And here we sit. Nodding tapestries, eating pistachios, it's humble guests, bearing witness, bearing witness, bearing witness to its beauty, that it may go on and on and on and on. Thank you.